Hey guys, this is Guy here with a new video. Today I'm gonna share with you my experience with this August smart lock. So I just came back home and I found a package sent to me by August with some new adapters in it for free. So I'm gonna tell you how I broke my lock and what I did to fix it in the rest of this video. Let's get started. So this is the August Smart Lock. I've been using it for the last three years. It's very convenient. It works with the application on the phone and also has a bridge that connects it to the internet so you can pretty much lock and unlock your door from anywhere using your Google Assistant or Alexa or any other uh, smart assistants that you may have. It has some beautiful features like the auto lock so it locks itself after a certain period of time that you can set on your phone and also the Bluetooth gives it the auto unlock option as well. So as soon as it senses you walking toward the door with your phone it unlocks the device right away. It uses your home Wi-Fi, your phone's Bluetooth and your location to unlock the door. So it, it's pretty safe. Uh, I had a lot of people over, so a lot of locking and unlocking going on. And I think they turned it in the wrong direction and they forced it hard, which actually worn out this piece of um, equipment. It's called um, the adapter. This one is the, is the piece that goes inside the lock and also goes in the door to manipulate the deadbolt. I actually took a long time to find out. First I thought it was the, the gears inside so I opened it. So yeah, so I had a chance to open it. I really like opening stuff because that's what I do. So I opened it and I lubricated the gears and everything and I put it back on. It worked for a couple days and then broke down again. So I had to reopen it and then put it back on for the second time and it did the same thing. So I figured that this was the issue because it was getting in here, but after working for a while, the, the small adapter would come forward and then the lock would be just spinning in itself without turning the deadbolt. So I went online trying to buy this from eBay or Amazon or from anyone online and couldn't find it. Then I went to the August website and found fortunately that they have an option to request part from them directly. I was able to request this and they sent me today these adapters for free. I didn't have to pay anything. Today I'm going to show you how I am putting it in the, on the door and actually I'm just going to open it to show the inside and I'll show you a little bit how it works with the app. It connects to the lock using Bluetooth and then you have this um, this green button that you can touch to lock and unlock the door so right now it's unlocked and now it's locked and you can click to unlock it as I said you can also use your Google Assistant and it will lock and unlock the door hey Google lock the front door sure requesting to lock the front door now I'm opening it to show you the inside So this is what the inside looks like. You can see that I put some uh, lubricants over here just to, to lubricate all the, the gears and uh, now it works just fine. Um, I also had to cut the wires to the speaker because I don't use it. So let me put it back together and uh, and I put it on a door. Now I'm gonna put it back on the door and um, hopefully this will be the last time that I have to fix this and we'll see what happens. Hey Google, lock the front door. Sure, requesting to lock the front door. The front door has been locked. Hey Google, unlock the front door. 
Can I have your security code to unlock the front door? You got it. Requesting to unlock the front door. The front door has been unlocked. That's all for today guys. Please don't forget to subscribe for more videos on science, technology, motivation and self-development. See you in the next video. Bye.